Welcome back to the Cave of Science. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm going to show you how to do a, a couple tricks with uh, with spreadsheets for your uh, your cupo on uh, gravity. And so the first one, I'd ask you to uh, get the average velocity. And some of you may already know this if you uh, use functions at all. So if I want to find the average velocity. Many of you have like 40 different uh, values. So instead of adding them all together hand by hand, you can highlight those values and go over here way to the right where it says functions and get average and you can see your it gives you your function here and you just click there and there's your average velocity for all your your numbers in there the other one if you if you choose to do it is acceleration remember acceleration is final velocity minus initial uh, all over time. Well you can actually set up a function for that and I'm going to do that real quick here too. Now so we wanted we're going to start uh, I'm going to start in cell 3 here because remember you want to find the final velocity minus initial so if, if I'm going to use these two here this would be my final minus my initial all over time. Well I got to find the time difference between two, these two values and uh, you can actually set up a function to do that. So I'm going to put that function in there right now. And let's, so we got equal, and you got open the parentheses. So I want, again, velocity, so I want B3 minus B2. So I'll just type that in B3 minus B2, close parentheses, because that's telling you how you want to work that, divided by the time. And I got to take the time difference between A3 and A2. So I'm going to open parentheses, A3 minus A2, close parentheses. And this gets me the first value here. So my uh, acceleration due to gravity is 9.91, but I want them all. So if you grab the little marker here and drag down and let go there's all your velocity or excuse me all your accelerations and if I want to take the average of all those accelerations I can go ahead and hit average and there's my average acceleration so again a nice little trick to learn uh, very simple function and uh, hope this helps you out